if turning them on section by section takes some time, well, imagine how long it takes to rig them all up. It helps explain why these Christmas lights are shining in mid-October. He's got it as on. Yeah. Because it takes several weeks for retired couple Helen and John to complete their display, which has become something of an annual tradition in Soham. It makes you feel proud, really, especially yes. the children. They get real yes. excited, you know. Yes. And they're all taking photographs with their little... Yes. Flat, and they're all looking they to them. see <laughs> how far we've got, yeah. haven't they? They say, oh, look, they've got something else up yeah. now. They started doing it nine years ago when their grandson was diagnosed with severe epilepsy, fundraising for three charities that supported him. Last year, their 600 separate installations helped raise more than £12,000, turning their home into something of a tourist attraction, even during a lockdown. But this year, there are other considerations. You're not worried about your electricity bill? Helen won't year. tell me what it is. I don't know what it is. <laughs> Will you? No. <laughs> she won't tell me. You're not giving the, the signal. Uh, no. She might frighten no. me. No. Despite the cost, they still hope to have it finished by mid-November. So if you find yourself in Soham looking for Christmas cheer, you'll know where to come. To be honest, you won't be able to miss it. Ben Chapman, ITV News, Cambridgeshire.